In the 2023 Nevada legislative session, Governor Joe Lombardo, you might recall, vetoed a $43 million extension of the pandemic era universal free school meals program. Now, the veto of the program, which provided funding from the U.S. Department of Agriculture, has forced the Washoe County School District to dip into its general budget to backfill it. Josh Benny reports on the current debate. It's about feeding kids. As simple as that. Our kids need to be fed in order to do their best, uh, in order to succeed in school. Delivered from Nevada Democrats. Nevada Democrats delivered Beth Smith's op-ed in a lunchbox to the Washoe Republican Party office as a symbolic gesture. It doesn't mean all Washoe County Republicans stand for or against the issue. The argument about it's available if you need it, that threshold is so low. Making just over $40,000 as a family of four is not very much money. And if you make a couple dollars over that, then you don't qualify. In the letter, Governor Joe Lombardo emphasized more than four-fifths of K-12 through students are automatically eligible to receive free school meals because of their school's Community Eligibility Provision, or CEP. Currently, 87% of schools offer automatic free school meals for all of their students, regardless of income. That encompasses 80% of students across the state. Furthermore, students who aren't automatically covered by their school's CEP status, they can apply through the district. Uh, every district has an application process. In his veto message, Governor Lombardo said the bill would contribute to food waste, claiming that up to 73% of school meals are thrown away. However, that statistic referred to the subcategory of vegetable. The Nevada Independent fact-checked this as false. We know that that was just a political talking point to justify vetoing guaranteed school meals, but it's not the truth. Yes, of course, some children don't eat all of their food any given day, but because some kids don't eat an entire meal doesn't mean that you don't feed them. Governing voters decide. Josh Many, 2 News, Nevada.